Welcome everyone to another five minute workout from John Gary TV on YouTube. I'm John Gary and today we are gonna be working in the well doing a really fun standing workout. As I said, it's quick, but it's effective. I'm using one light spring. So it's a blue spring on the balanced body. If you're working on Marathew, it's also a blue spring. Always adjust your resistance according to what you need know, though not to what I need. I'm gonna stand back away so that I can place my hands on the top of the shoulder rest and find a spot where they're just out in front of my hands a little bit. Then I put my fingers on the front side and I'm gonna begin with a cat. I flex the spine, pulling the carriage back and then returning. It should feel actually really nice on the back. Exhale to pull and return. So what I wanna do is try to bring the top of my head and my tailbone together not going to happen, at least for me, but it gives you that image of a C curve in the spine, which really helps activate the abs and also lengthen those back extensors. Keep the shoulders away from the ear. Use your exhale to pull. Inhale to return. Two more. And one more. Nice little warm up here. Let's go into a little oblique work. So I'm gonna keep my right hand where it is and I'm gonna take my left hand on top of it. I start in a little bit of side flexion in my spine. I'm gonna drop my head between my arms, curl my tailbone under, and it's like I'm doing that cat just on the one side. Both sides are still moving, but I'm focusing on this right side. Bringing my rib and my hip together. And again, curl and return. Curl and lengthen. Let's do five more. Five, and back out, and exhale, four, and return. We've got three, and two, one more, and back. Now, I'm going to take my left hand on the left shoulder rest, right hand on top of it, do a little side bend on that side to start, and end that position, and then flex, and return. Feel the difference? Exhale, curl. And my knees will straighten a little bit as I tuck under and in and curl. Let's do five more and five. Slowly return. Use your exhale here. Four. Inhale to return. And three. Curl two and one. And then just come back to the center and roll up. Now I've got the headrest in the up position. I'm gonna stand back a little ways and put my leg right against the side of the frame of the reformer. And my other foot is gonna go right in front of the headrest on the carriage. I don't care whether or not the ball of the foot is on, I want the heel to press down. I'm gonna dig down and pull. And return and exhale, pull two. So you should feel as you press your heel down and drag that carriage toward you, the hamstring muscles really kicking in here. And exhale, pull and return. Five more, we've got five and four and curl three and two and one. Woo, we can feel it, feel those hamstrings crying out to you. Now go to the other side, leg against the frame, Heel in front of the headrest and pull and press down at the same time. Two. And exhale, three. And four. As you press that heel down and squeeze it towards you, you're gonna feel those hamstrings. Five. And exhale, six. We got seven. And eight. Nine. And 10, beautiful. So a little bit of that posterior chain working there. And now we're gonna come around and I'm gonna take all the springs off and then come forward, bring that carriage back to me, go right against the back of the frame here and take your hands at least halfway up the carriage. Uh, further, if you're taller, because we're gonna go from this pike position into a plank as your heels lift, lower your hips, and then pull back into the pike. And come forward, and exhale, pull back, sending your sit bones back behind you. Try to keep the back nice and long and fold from the hips. Don't worry, you're still working your abs. <laughs> if you can't feel it, you will in a second. And exhale, pull. Control the carriage. If you're hitting the stopper, 
you're not getting full range, you want to take your hands further forward on the carriage. Exhale, pull. Inhale out. Exhale, pull. Now I'm going to go into that plank position and then just the arms move forward and they pull back into this really crazy long stretch exercise. And exhale, pull. Inhale out. And pull. Just two more. And just one more. And curl all the way back up to the top. Well, that is a quick full body workout. I hope that you enjoyed it. For a full length workout, actually hundreds and hundreds of them, come to johngarytv.com, check out our app, John Gary TV, and please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the like button. Thanks for joining me. See you again next time.